Well, if you have a good therapist, and if you've had a good therapist for a long time, why would you want to leave that therapist? The relationship could reach a point where it's friendly, it's supportive, it's interactive, it's enjoyable for both of you. But therapy isn't meant to be the same as finding a long-lost friend or finding a substitute for a spouse or a parent. And you do have a responsibility as a patient in therapy, just as the therapist has a responsibility, to anticipate the end stage and and to think, how would it feel to graduate? And how do I want to do that? And I I would certainly welcome a bit more of of that in my long-term patients. And I, I know I... I think about it. The last thing I want to do is to say, well, it's over, or it's time to stop, and have that be sudden, unexpected, and and feel like being pushed out the door. So both the, the patient and the therapist should raise the issue well before term, it's called termination, well before termination is on the table and talk about how you would feel and how you would look back over the progress that's been made and how you might think about one another afterward. I I personally, I, I think because of some of my mentors, have learned to feel and to say that for the rest of my life, I'm going to be interested. I'd, I'd like to hear from you. But I'd also like to reach a point where I know We stop, there's been progress, there's been achievement, and both of us feel good about it. So let's sum it up. Number one, anticipate ending before you're ready for ending. And think what it might be like. I think the analogy to leaving a good teacher is a good one. If you've had a really good teacher, you've learned something, and you like the idea that years later, maybe you could drop in on that teacher or you could send a letter saying, uh, here's the job that I now have. I feel fulfilled. You helped me. And I think that teacher feels very warm and gratified. I, when I've been a teacher, I felt very good to know that down the road it, it meant something. Uh, and people have had coaches but it's not the same thing as a, as a parent. And a therapist is not a parent and is not a friend. More like a teacher, more like a coach, someone who's with you for a period of time. And then, you, and then it's, I think it is your responsibility to think about how it would feel to say goodbye, to say thank you, and to graduate. So that's, that's your responsibility. Anticipate it talk it over, and do your best to get there and to feel good about it.